Hello there, RhinoHorn125, and today we're going to be doing a, another update on Ash vs. Jason. Now you're probably wondering, why do another update when we already did a 41 minute one? Well, we're going to, because there's more stuff to talk about, so let's get to it. So before we get to specifically Ash vs. Jason, I'm going to go ahead and talk about some things to uh, expect on this channel within the next week or so. Um, number one, definitely go check out our new, uh, Jenny Boo Kills, is, um, one of the best ones we've done so far, in my opinion, and also, I believe my brother's here, and our friend Riley, so, go check that out if you like that kind of thing, and then later on this week, uh, expect, um, another Officer Friendly, um, if you follow me on Instagram, you already know what it is, but I'm not gonna really say what it is on here, just go on my Instagram, if you don't know, I guess you'll see. Um, which we just did Officer Friendly, and to explain Officer Friendly very quickly is a character that I came up with years ago, which I just now got around to getting the stuff for and then doing videos of, which is just kind of a um, stereotypical cop, you know, 80s cop character that just takes down bad guys, basically, and, um, you know, I'll be explaining that further in another video some other time, but... One thing to expect this week is just that, and then um, anything else I decide to uh, put on. But as of right now, that's basically it. So just stay tuned for Janie View Kills within the next few months or so, um, and the Clone Part 31 coming soon, um, sometime this spring. So stay tuned for that as well. Okay, so now finally on to Ash vs. Jason, which is what you're probably all here for. Now, as expected, it will be released around October, definitely in fall, just within that time span. Not when there's snow on the ground, but if we do, in case, have a really good winter and um, Christmas break is a really good time to do it, it will be then. And that has been the same since we last did an update. Um, but what we're really here to talk about, uh, not the release, because that's just kind of staying the same, is costume-wise. And... Not stuff we have planned, because then that's kind of spoilers, so we're not going to get into that. But I'm going to quickly go over what I have for my Ash costume so far, which has not very much changed since, um, based on uh, stuff I've been able to get and, you know, been able to work on. So chainsaw-wise, it is, mm, it's right in between the stage. I have the main things off that I need off at the moment, and I just need to get a few um, more materials, and then I'll be able to just completely finish it. And that's basically uh, it with the chainsaw. I'm not going to be doing any video on that. It'll be done when it's done. And I might do a video on the finished product, but I'm not going to do a DIY. There is actually, in fact, a DIY on how to do that, which I've explained in another video. Just look up Ash Chainsaw DIY. There you go. I'm not going to put it in the link in the comments or anything. So just, uh, you know, find it. But uh, anyway, uh, costume, like the full costume-wise, uh, I have the pants, thinking on getting some other ones, and I have the shirt, and I did find a shirt that is actually better, but I'm not going to really go into that. That'll, that's just shirt and pants, so not much going on there. And the uh, gauntlet, or uh, mechanical hand, I'm getting from a guy, which I'm going to be ordering within the next few days. So um, I have to pay him, and then he'll send it in at some point when he's done with it. So that's about it on the Ash costume. Uh, which Ash costume, you know, is pretty standard, brown boots, brown pants, uh, blue shirt, and then the chainsaw, mechanical hand if needed, and then the shotgun, which the shotgun has been finished for about a year and a half now, maybe longer than that, so I don't have to worry there. But that's, that's it on the uh, Ash cosplay for Ash vs. Jason. Okay, so now my brother is going to be going over the update for the Jason cosplay for the video. Okay, so uh, first of all, the Jason costume, we originally planned it to be part seven and maybe Jason goes to hell if we couldn't find anything else, but um, we ha I had some difficulties with the part seven costume and it takes a lot more time than other Jason costumes do, so it'll just be a cosplay for later on sometime. So I decided that I was just gonna make my favorite version of Jason, which is the Versus version, Freddy Versus Jason, and uh, we were okay with that for the film, so that's now going to be the new Jason in the film, with um, an added chain around the neck for some portion of the film, because... You know, no spoilers, just a chain. Yeah. Not really much but to say. So far, I've uh, finished the t-shirt and the sweater and the jacket um, of the costume. 
Uh, there's a little bit of paint touch-ups here and there that I might be adding in case I'm not happy with the final products put together. But um, the pants I don't have yet, and the boots I have and everything. Um, I ordered the mask recently from Escape Theory Studios website. Um, I'm not going to put a link in the description down below or anything. You can just look it up on Google like everyone else. But I ordered that a couple weeks ago, and it usually takes within like three weeks to ship. So that should be here recently, and I'll probably be uploading an unboxing of it for JW. Also, the Chevron, but that was for another mask. So that was that for any, another mask. So that's unrelated. Does that have anything to do with this at all? And. Um, also, continuing with the costume, uh, I've ordered the hockey masks that will be coming in a couple weeks, so I'll probably upload an unboxing video for JW52 and put a review on Sharkfin13, which I'm now uploading on that channel once again. And the hood, as far as the hood goes, I'm also going to order that from Escape Theory Studios website. I was originally going to get a Dark Side Studios hood, but I found out the hair falls out over time and stuff, and it's just not good quality, so... Keep Theory Studios, but that I'm probably going to be getting sometime in June, before July, because I'm going to a convention, maybe. So I'm going to try to get that soon, and uh, just keep updated on our JW52 channel. The description for that channel might be in the description down below, I don't know. I may I may put it along with his uh, <clears throat> Sharkfin, or... Sharkfin13. Yeah, Sharkfin13 uh, channel, which, like he said, he now uses... So, uh, if you hear watch that and you watch this, then since it's starting to put videos on, I will be putting a link down below for you guys to go check that out once again. And uh, just like he was saying, we're probably going to be going to a convention, So, which I didn't really explain, but I plan to have the full Ash costume done by um, early July. Hopefully the entire thing will be done. Same with uh, my Jason costume. Maybe not the chainsaw, but that doesn't matter because I'm going to be going uh, to the... Well, if we go to the um, convention, the horror convention, I... Days of the Dead. Days of the Dead. Um, when we go there, uh, I plan on being Ash, but a somewhat beat-up Ash. And I'm just going to use the gauntlet, which I will have by then. But it's not guaranteed that I'll have the chainsaw done. It's just more depends on if I go to Menards or Lowe's by then, uh, which... I need to kind of write down a list of the specific little things that I need for it. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty much it on that there. Also, stay updated on JW52 for more updates on the actual things like the gauntlet. And behind the scenes. Behind the scenes, like the gauntlet and updates on the costumes and stuff we may put on there every now and then. If not, we'll probably just talk about it again. Yeah. I may put uh, other updates on this channel, as I always do, because this is the main source of updates for any of our videos. But JNB52 is, <clears> if you <throat> like behind the scenes and uh, even more smaller updates, uh, like costume stuff, definitely subscribe to that channel if you enjoy our videos and, and uh, you're looking forward to Ash vs. Jason. And if you don't give a crap, then, well, I guess, whatever then. So there you have it. Basically, I am, I would have to say, probably 85% done with the uh, Ash cosplay, and he is... 75%. Yeah, if we're putting it in percentages. And we should be done within some time in the summer. Really, it doesn't matter. We have till literally next fall. That's a long time. It's My main even... drive, though, is to go to a convention with the costume. Yeah, so. it's, it's not even uh, summer yet, and it's right at the beginning of spring. But, yeah, I do have somewhat of a little bit. I at least want to have the gauntlet by uh, the beginning of July um, or, like, towards the end of uh, June because of the convention. But if I don't, then, I mean, that's a shame. I guess I won't I guess I guess won't dress up or I'll just be Michael Myers, which I always have that cosplay just laying around in need. So if I, that does end up happening, I will do that. But, yeah, that is kind of our main drive to get it done really fast, uh, not like way too fast where it's uh, half done, but, you know, well done is the convention. So, but, you know, like I said, we have plenty of time to get it done and we will most likely, for sure, probably have another update, but this was mainly to 
just tell you guys that everything hasn't, not much has changed, but also the fact that we have, yes, changed from Friday the 13th Part 7 Jason to Versus Jason, which, personally, I love Part 7 Jason, as a lot of people do, and I, you know, love, and, uh, since we kind of grew up with it more than Friday the 13th movies is, uh, which is, is actually right there, is, um, Versus Jason, which I would have to say... I like just as much, but in different ways. You know, it's kind of hard for me to choose between them, personally. Uh, he can choose easily, you know, like Versus, but for me. But, you know, I think that the Versus one fits because of the chain. And since from Part 6, he goes into the water and has a chain on and comes out, you know, Part 7 has a chain on there. Uh, but we're changing it up. And I will explain that full thing in another video at some point. Maybe even after uh, Ash vs. Jason, because it will have spoilers in it. So I wouldn't, uh, you know, set the clock or put it on your calendar when that update comes out, because it's going to be quite some time. So just, I guess you'll get it when you get it, and it'll be the full rundown of the story of our timeline in the Friday the 13th and Evil Dead connected um, kind of storyline. But yeah, that's basically it. Uh, if you guys enjoyed, like, comment, and subscribe. And go subscribe to Sharkfin13. Like we said, he's uploading again on that channel every now and again. And uh, stay tuned for not new too videos. Frequently. Yeah, not too frequently. But also stay tuned for not too frequently videos on this channel. But as of right now, I will have um, some videos coming out soon. So stay tuned for that. Anything you want to add? Um, uh, look forward to the last you will see of Bill Smith. Well, yeah, look for the last you will see of Bill Smith. Go follow me on Instagram, rhinohorn25j. If you don't have Instagram, then just wait for the video. And if you want to follow me on Instagram, I run a horror fan page, uh, Ghosts of Horror. Yeah, and I also used to run a uh, Wolverine fan page, uh, Wolf of the Past, which I got logged out of and don't know the password to, so that's that's a bunch of dog shit. Alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed, uh, stay tuned for more like I said, and subscribe, and thanks for watching, and just one more thing, uh, go subscribe to my Rhino Horn 25, 25 not 125, which I have explained before, but I'm going to explain it again since it's the last little bit of this video. Because eventually, be switching over to the Yeah, I will, so when Ash vs. Jason comes out, I'm going to upload it to this channel, and I'm going to upload it to that one. Get his, try to get as many dedicated subscribers on this channel to that one, so but pretty much start go subscribe. If you like what I do on this channel in any way, uh, any of the videos you like, uh, just subscribe to that one because when we do that, I will be switching permanently and I will no longer upload. My last video on this channel will not be Ash vs. Jason. I will upload Ash vs. Jason and maybe a week or so later be telling you guys, or maybe a month, who knows, telling you guys of the switch that I will be switching from this channel to that one. So just know that, just let it be known. If you know someone that watches my channel and you also watch my channel, tell them if they don't see this. Just anything like that. It just needs to be kind of known across my YouTube so people aren't so confused and be like, wait, what happened? But I, like I said, will be putting a video on this channel of it specifically. So if you don't see this by then, then you'll know. So... Thanks for watching, and bye. Have a fantastic day.